Here in Aotearoa, we're so lucky, you know, we've got 15,000 kilometres of coastline. We need to be careful to protect that. Unfortunately, we're the 10th most wasteful country in the world per capita. So I think that would shock a lot of Kiwis. They say you cannot improve what you do not measure. You know, understanding the problem allows us to work on the most appropriate solutions. We want to use data to inform what is the problem out there on our coastlines? How is it changing? And we want that to inspire action. Litter intelligence is empowering citizen scientists because we're using really high quality technology with some simple methodologies to make sure what we're collecting is credible. Being a citizen scientist to me means that we're taking responsibility for, for our resource and what we have. We've got a patch of the beach here at Little Shoal Bay. We map out a certain part of the beach, it's as easy as that. We just have a look at, at what we find. We take it back over to the sustainable coastlines and we review all of that data. Enter it into our application, click submit, and then that data enters the National Litter Database. People really like the visualizations. They like that they can see their results immediately and that they can compare them to other parts of the country or even their own space. Microsoft's Power BI dashboards are a great way for us to be able to visualize the data we're collecting. We can see trends, we can see which litter categories are most impactful at which places. Artificial intelligence can play a really, really important role in us identifying the right solutions for the right communities. So alongside data and information about the problem, we have an action platform which sits alongside that, recommending the right solutions at the right place at the right time. In Wellington, we find more plastic straws than we do in anywhere else in the country. We took that data to local businesses who started implementing a voluntary ban on plastic straws. There are a lot of data sets out there. We have ocean current data, tidal data, weather data. All of these things impact on how litter is distributed around our coastlines. So with this project we see with Microsoft's Cognitive Services Suite, the ability to pull that information together and gain true insights into this problem.